rear data, they give you new wings. We can go ahead and put these new ones on there. I hope they don't leak. I hope they A1 comes thin. Got these little clips that hold them on there. I'll hold them in.
to his little radiator. Everything up. screws up from over here. Four lines, one mean what? Four. Four lines back on, five lines back on. And you gotta put the main cooling lines back on there. You done. And hopefully, everything working right. Hopefully. And you got no whammies, no issues, no problems.
another one in there. You stop anything from leaking all everywhere. I already got a mess to clean up. Tighten these things up. Tighten, tighten, tighten. Over here. Here we go. Oh, what a long day. Long day, long, long day. Should have been this long. So we put these big cool lines on. Let's 
Okay. Right, well, no, we just did the little radiator hose. What you gotta do? But these things so wide. And you can't get them closed. Well, you can't, if you close your pliers up more, you ain't gonna, they ain't gonna be wide enough to get around it. So you get it wedged in there, and you just start tightening the knob up. So that way when you lock down on it, it'll open all the way up. Screw on this one. I'm trying to bend these pins on the radio. There we go. This one on. Can I work around this? This is what I'm thinking. I might come back and put that fan on. If all I gotta do is put the fan on in the morning and the shroud in. That's cool. But, um, uh, I want to make sure that ain't nothing leaking. These transmission lines, transmission cooling lines, all cooling lines, the radiator, especially these heater core lines. So if I do this, I can get a shroud in there. Hmm. Well, I can see them lines with that shroud in there, I want to say. But what I'm about to do, I'm about to go ahead and wash this thing out. Oh, I'm about to go ahead and do it. Look at this. Put these little heat shields on here. Let's help protect the lines. Some of the heat from the motor. What other than that? I ain't need this one came off the bottom on the other one. Mm, I'm gonna stick it. Let's see up top, it don't get hot. It don't get hot. Oh, your hot water come out the bottom. Cool water. I wanna say, yeah, cool water come out the top, but then everything drained down, so. I'm gonna shove this one on the bottom one down here. We got one. I'm gonna put two of them on there. The motor Yeah. 
I'm going to put this back on there. Clean this photo, it's slippery. But um, I put this last clamp on, put that hose on. I don't know, I might pull that back out. But um, yeah, I'm gonna put this last one on. About to fill it up with coolant. Let it run for a minute. Then I'm gonna pull it out. I gotta clean this stuff. Clean that stuff up. I'll put that clutch fan on tomorrow. It ain't no biggie. It ain't going nowhere. So, even if I do drive some wind tonight, it still ain't no biggie. It ain't going to get cool outside. So, it ain't like it's going to be overheating. Uh, but, that's what I'm about to do. I'm tired, boy. I'm tired, boy. I've got here about six, seven hours. Because I ran into some issues. Ran into some issues.
think this should be okay. Fill this thing up and we'll crank it up and let it squeal for a minute because that belt wet and just let it run. Let's fill it up. I just try to get this thing so cool it in. I want to let it run for a while. I'm to check it in the morning to make sure it ain't leak. I really want to get this float thing cold and grease. And Three gallon, three gallon. But uh, put the second one in there. I got one more if I need it.
thirsty man. So far, so good. My phone, man. I need my light. So far, so good. Let's check these right here. I don't see no transmission. There's an oil on these lines over here. Let's see if this thing got a lot of... I need to add some food to it. Yeah, it's at the bottom. I'm putting a little gallon in there. Put the rest of this down here. I'm probably going to rest a little more. tomorrow. Three gallons right there. I'm sucking it down. It's sucking it on down. I'm gonna let it run for a minute, guys. There goes my little steam coming from the, all that water that's on it. I turned the heat on. I want to check them hoses right there. Yeah, one more in the road, yeah. Uh, you see you got some steam coming off of it. We're gonna let it run for a minute, bro. I'm gonna get some more cooling. Let's see what the turning stat at. Let's see what it's at. So it's almost at, at 160. Ain't got hot yet in here. Still going cold well. I mean, ain't at 160, it's at 100 and is that 200? I guess that's two. Over 160 to 210. So I guess that might be 200, 180, somewhere from that. The heat should be warm by now though. Should be getting warm. Let's see. Let me give it a few more minutes. Let's see if the AC works. How cold it gets. The AC, so that's the compressor kicking in. That noise you hear, it's just that wet belt. I should dry in a minute. We'll give it a minute. Three o'clock in the morning. But, but as you can see, bro, everything is dry. Everything is dry. I don't see no leaks. Let's go right here. You don't see no leaks or nothing wet down there. I gotta get some cooling though. Yeah, I gotta get some more cooling. 
put on some of the leaks on the thing I do is put this top shroud on and the fan on the mar. And I'll be done. Now, I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna go the same models on that I bought this uh, part from. I'm gonna see if I can talk them into just letting me use the tool. Why well, now? Hey man, let me, I gotta put this clutch fan on. Hey man, let me use the tool. Put that clutch fan on. Uh, then put that top shroud on. Done. But uh, I don't know, I'm gonna have to, one day, I'm gonna have to uh, let it sit and run. So uh, I'm gonna check this AC compressor. Just turn the AC on, let it sit and run. And uh, see if it stay cool. If it don't, and I know it got free on it, then go and place next thing you do, place compressor. So, but hey, that's gonna wrap the vlog for today. Don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe, turn on all post notifications, click that bell. The bell let you know every time I post. Till then, we out.